Hey everyone, welcome back to Williamson Ridge Outdoors. Today we're going to be heading to the Paul Bunyan Show in Cambridge, Ohio to pick up our new wood splitter. Plus check out a little bit of the show and see what and all is going on there. And uh, we're getting loaded up and ready to head that way. So guys, we made it to the Paul Bunyan Show in Cambridge, Ohio. And we're walking in right now and we're going to take you along with us and show you some of the machines and equipment that they have here. This mulcher, I've never seen one like walking up to it and looking into it, but man, that thing looks crazy. Looks like something you'd see on Indiana Jones when he's about to get chopped up in one of those machines or something. They're like the rock crusher. This thing is like a log splitter on the end of a bobcat skid steer. Here's a uh, firewood processor, smaller one. This is pretty cool, it's a dump trailer with a crane built onto it so that you can load logs and stuff into it without having to uh, have a separate piece of equipment all built on your trailer. thing's so awesome eight wheel drive flexes in the middle
we've made it back from our little road trip to the Paul Bunyan show in Cambridge, Ohio. And uh, we did make it back with our Easton made wood splitter. So we're gonna try to get this thing unloaded before it gets dark on us and at least try it out a little bit this evening and uh, kind of get a little footage of that. Also, um, we didn't get a whole lot of footage of the Paul Bunyan show. There's so much stuff there that for the time that we had, the show was only from nine to three today. And I think we got there, I think it was about 10, 30 or 11. And, um, but there's so much stuff there that you just can't cover it all in that time. They have stuff inside buildings like craft things and, and uh, woodworkers and people turning uh, wood on lathes and that kind of stuff. Uh, there was a guy making wooden hats and bowls and just all kinds of woodworking stuff. And, you know, not only that, but they, they have the small things like that all the way up into the huge forestry machines. So they have a little bit of everything for everybody. And it's a really cool show. I really enjoyed going around and walking around. So I hope you enjoyed the footage that we got there. Um, we'll get a little bit more footage of this Easton made wood splitter and we'll get it unloaded, all that good stuff. We'll come back and um, we'll do an in-depth look over on the machine here in just a day or so. And then of course we're gonna put it to the test or put it to work I, I don't think there's any test in this machine i think the machine is built heavy enough that really not anything that i've got that's really going to be testing it too much um but we're going to put it to work and try to get all of our wood split up that we've got up here i've actually not split any wood other than the time that i spent with the county line to see how much wood we could split in an hour with it and uh, we'll probably do the same test with this one, it's gonna split so much faster and so much easier than what the county line does. So really looking forward to that. ahead and fire this thing up and try to run a few pieces of wood through it before it gets dark and um, I'll be doing some videos upcoming videos on I'm going to compare this to your standard residential model and show you the differences of why that you would buy one like this versus you know residential model splitter uh, also go through and show you all the features and everything that's that's on this the build quality and just go in-depth detail on this splitter and uh then we're going to find out how much wood it'll split in an hour so we can kind of compare that to our residential one that we've done before. So make sure you subscribe and keep up with all that stuff because I mean, there's, there's going to be some good stuff coming up. This one, it has the lift on there and you'll be able to raise and lower the logs. You can also use it for a work platform. So I just really am excited about doing this. So let's get started and get some stuff split up before it gets too dark to be able to see anything and we'll see how she runs.
that thing is an absolute beast and there's a daylight and dark difference between running a machine like this and running a residential splitter I mean just the power the speed and you know they rate machines and stuff like the you know like the county line from tractor supply at 25 ton but I'm sure they have some type of a way to kind of manipulate that tonnage out of that machine because I have to go through and check I'll get all the details on this but I'm pretty sure this one's not rated you know any higher than 25 or, or maybe around that area and I'll find out and on my in-depth videos and showing all the details and stuff I'll have that information so um, but wow what a difference so I'm excited about it it's getting dark I'm gonna have to uh, wrap it up so make sure you hit that subscribe button to follow along with us uh, get more footage of the Easton made 916 is the model of this one and follow along with us projects on the farm firewood wood splitting and real world reviews on this Easton made splitter because wow it's awesome anyways like I say subscribe follow along with us for more videos on the Easton made wood splitter and uh, click that like button and thanks for watching mm -hmm.